has corn in it, people. has corn in it. Hi, everybody. Robert Jones back in the tasting corner with you today. And today I have something fun. A friend brought me, I should say some family brought me, um, the Copico Brown Coffee from the Philippines. Um, this is a couple packets here. Um, now, I will say I had I had tried it. This was months ago, but now I don't remember what it tastes like. So I thought it'd be fun to do a taste test with you guys. This is the brown coffee. Brown coffee. I'm not quite sure why it's called brown coffee. Um, it says tastier with 10% more content. Like my videos, 10% more content. <laughs> I think that's funny. Um, it says on here, it says uh, brown coffee, net weight 55 grams. The Just Right Blend Coffee Mix. Yeah, that's uh, it says uh, P10 only for two cups. I don't know what P10 means. Maybe that's the price. Anyway, it's a, like a double, a double thing. So this is two different servings. Let me see what it says on the back here. You guys can see what the back looks like. Um, it says nutritional facts, facts, bright lights, can't read. Uh, one sacket equals one container is 120 calories. Ingredients, whoa. That's some tiny, tiny ingredients. Let's see if I can even make it up. Uh, sugar, non-dairy creamer, great. Um, um, solids, oh, it's so tiny, it's like two point. Sodium... Citrate, coffee concentrate, malt extract, skim milk, milk flavor, vanillin, oh, allergies, uh, milk, malt, soybeans. May contain traces of maize. Has corn in it, people. Has corn in it. Coffee with corn. This is from Timahara Marketing Corporation of, forgive my butchery, of Mandu City? Mandau City, Philippines. Product of Indonesia. What? What? So it's from Indonesia, not the Philippines, but it's distributed in the Philippines. So apparently Indonesia, which is very close to the Philippines, is making something for Filipinos. How exciting. Panoy Express Coffee. Um, it says to add 220 milliliters, 220 milliliters to 80 degree, I'm assuming that's Celsius water. Um, stir and enjoy. It doesn't even say that. It just says 280 mil stir. All right, so here's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna say, yay! And now I'm gonna make pause and I'm gonna make some hot water and then I'm gonna come back here and we'll stir this up and give it a taste for you guys. All right, let me go make some hot water. Okay, you guys, I'm back with kopi and I've got my kettle of steaming. Can you guys see the steam? Oh, steamy. Okay, so what I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna take snippy, you know, snippy. Now I have to laugh because we always make fun of, um, not make fun of, but have fun with language with uh, my Filipino friends because they always say, Kopi, I'd like to have a cup of Kopi. And now I know why, because it says Kopi. Kopi. So that's kind of fun. All right, let me split this in half because it's two packets. Boom. And then get this down, get this down, and cut off the top here with snip, snippy, snippy. Cut off the top, and there you go. And now... Have. It smells like fake coffee. Okay, so there you go. Fake coffee. All right. And because I just I just love it, I have a tiny, tiny cup for one cup and a tiny spoon because I love tiny spoons. And I'm gonna put this in here. Oh. And then, carefully as to not burn the shit out of myself, put some hot water in here. So here's a hot tip. I noticed that when you make things that are mixes, if you put a little bit and then mix it up until it's like a mud and stir, 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 stir. And then once it's dissolved, put the rest of your hot water. There's your hot tip. Hot tip, literally hot tip. All right, and then give it a little stir. Now you guys can see it's a little creamy. I love the sound of a spoon in a hot cup. Oh, all right, let's give it a little stir. You can see it's creamy and delicious. Let me get rid of this spoon. Turn this around because I'm right-handed. All right. 
It smells like instant coffee with creamer. All right, here goes brown coffee cool. Oh, that is very sweet. Can you guys see? There's like special effects happening here with so much steam. Um, yeah, it tastes like it tastes like instant coffee. It's pretty sweet. How much sugar is in here? How much sugar is in here? 17 grams of sugar. So it's quite sweet. I can't say that this would be my everyday cup of coffee, but if I was camping or on the road, I can totally see how people can get addicted to this. It's very easy. It's like hot water, pour, boom, you know? It's like anything instant. And as far as instant coffee goes, I, I have to say it's actually pretty smooth. It's um it's nice. Can you see the color? It's kind of brown. All right, there you go. Cup go. I bet this would be really good over ice. Mmm, there's an idea. I think I might just do that. All right, you guys. I'm Robert Jones. This is Taste Test. I hope you guys enjoyed this, trying out the Filipino cup of coffee. Um, come on back for more. Subscribe. Come back for more. I'd love to have you guys come back for more. Tell me what you think. Um, my Pinoy friends out there, do you guys drink cup of do you like Copico? Is there other things I should be trying? Um, feel free. My mailing box is down below, and I just renewed it yesterday. So it's ready to go for more stuff. Load it up. I'd love to taste the world for you guys. All right, you guys. I'm Robert Jones, and I hope to see you next time. Take care. Bye.